hello what's up guys welcome back to the channel so we are going to try to answer some question here i don't know if it's going to be the perfect answer to this question but yeah we can also use it on some web pages so here our friend talal is saying how to create a search bar in a web page which is useful to search files so it's more like a search engine creating a search engine and if you are to check the comments, I try to tell him to use the jQuery mobile. So jQuery mobile has this field table search engine you can create. So let us first create a document here. I'm going to save it on the desktop where I drop all of my files. So we are going to create, call it a search, search bar.html. So save this. And the text editor I'm using Subrame, so you just have to write this and press enter, and the document is there. So this one is going to be OCC or Stone Cold Cipher Search Engine. Search Engine. So that's the title of the web page. Now, the next thing you have to do is go to jQuery, jQuerymobile.com. jQueryMobile.com. Navigate to the download area where you see my cursor is. Scroll down. So if you want to work offline, you can download this file, the zip file, which is having JavaScript, CSS, and images. But right now, I don't need that. I just need this content delivery network links. So the CDNs. I'm just going to copy this. So. I'm going to copy this, come to my editor, include it in the head section. So you may see we are missing a lot of tags in the head section, but this is just for the jQuery mobile. It's all of our friend is question. So with that, I'm just going to create a basic layout for the jQuery mobile data role because page so if there are many pages you can give this an id so that you can target it in other pages so we say div and this one is going to be data role equals header create another div this one will be data role equals main some others can call it content but for me i do it like this ui dash content so in other ways it can work so you can call it data row equals content the way you want to state it so just follow what i'm doing and here we shall say data role equals footer so this is the basic layout of the jquery mobile page this is our page you can go on and add other pages below but this is the basic layout. I'm just going to call this. I'm just going to give it H1. We call it OCC search engine. Search engine. So this is the header engine. So all the content is going to be going in between this div, this parent div of the data role main. So what we are going to be putting there is going to be here. What is going to be displayed on all main section of the web page i'm just going to create here some copyright symbol copyright Austin code cipher 2017 so let's preview this in the browser right now we're just going to be having the head the head and footer so as you can see we're having the header and this side we're having the footer so the footer is this side because I've not given it a markup. So let's make it a paragraph. Put it in the browser. Yeah, and this is what we are having. So I'm just going to make it an H1. H H1. Save that. Yeah. So it is also centered. So this is the header main content and the footer so we are going to create our search engine 
in between this div tag so i'm just going to create another list and i'm going to pass items the list items to it so this one's going to be html i'm just going to copy this different so this one's going to be css this one's going to be javascript this one is going to be bootstrap bootstrap this one is going to be jquery so save that and if you are we have to preview this in the browser this is what we are having we want to make this a search engine that will capture all this content now you just had data role data role equals list view save this and it's going to be put in a list format what you have to do let's make these links so we are just going to add this href the hang tag and they are going to be going nowhere so go on including this on every list item you are having on the web page so these ones are going to be our files to search on a web page close it with the hang tag close it close it and the good thing with jquery mobile you see how it's going to do your list items are you seeing they are now list items on a web page but let's try to put this in a mobile format so that we can see it properly how it's being controlled so are you seeing this is the header so these are the items we want to filter what you have to do is go to the text editor and we are going to add here another attribute it's called data filter equals true so this will this one is going to give us the search engine we are asking for so let's preview it here in the phone emulator reload it's reloading ah as you can see we are having our now search engine we can look for html and you see they will bring html only you can search for css and it will bring css only you can search for javascript and it brings the javascript only but remember you want to make this a search engine mainly you don't want this to be displayed you don't want it to be displayed on a web page you want the person to come and search for the items and they appear so what you have to do is you can add another attribute data dash filter dash reveal reveal equals true save that and preview this in our phone emulator how it's going to be as you can see they are not displayed so the person will just have to write html and they bring html on the the files you want to be searched on your website when somebody wants javascript we write javascript and javascript will pop up and you have to make another page for javascript where the person will see the content so mainly that's how you can create a search bar or search engine on your web page let's say you want such this you want to change this filter items so you want to customize it your own way you can just add another attribute here called data dash filter dash place order how you do it in html the press order and write what you want so search search in a programming language so this is too long you can make something cool than this such any programming language so let's preview this 
and as you can see the placeholder has changed so the person will write anything are you seeing when you place b o they will bring every search engine that has that phase so t html has t javascript has t bootstrap has t so if this tutorial was useful to you i guess subscribe to the channel like the video share it on different social medias hope we have answered this question let's scroll back a friend who was like how to create a search bar in a web page which is useful to search files so i hope this tutorial for jquery mobile has helped you to create that search engine thanks for watching